Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'd like to show you this classic and simple buttercream and sprinkles cake. This cake is three five inch vanilla cake layers with vanilla American buttercream as well. The first layer of buttercream I'm adding is called the crumb coat. This is just a thin layer of buttercream that traps all the crumbs in, making the outer layer easier. It doesn't need to look perfect or beautiful, it can be a little rough, you're just giving the cake the shape it needs. After finishing the crumb coat layer, I like allow my cake to sit in the fridge to chill and crust over or set for about 30 minutes before beginning the outer layer. I'm using this mint green colored American buttercream for the outer layer today. After I've finished covering the cake with my offset spatula, I like to use a scraper to smooth it out. I prefer metal because you can heat them up under warm water between passes to really smooth the buttercream and remove air bubbles. When leveling the tops of cakes, I like to lightly pull the buttercream in from the edge just toward the center with my small angled offset spatula. I'm going to pipe a border at the top of the cake with a 1M tip and I'm filling my piping bag with this pink American buttercream that's a bit thicker consistency than the frosting I used to cover the cake. When piping a spiral border, squeeze a little bit right onto the cake to anchor the buttercream to the top of the cake and pipe continuous spirals around the top of the cake with each new one laying on top of the last one. If you need to pause, take a break, adjust to your buttercream, pull the buttercream in toward the center, and make your adjustments, and then continue on top of that spiral. I like to say draw a slinky with your piping bag if you remember those. Covering a large area of your cake with sprinkles, I like to set the cake on a baking sheet with raised edges so the sprinkles don't go bouncing all over the place. Thank you so much for watching this one and don't forget to subscribe.